What is up, YouTube? It's your boy, Condor. We've got a search and destroy in Favela, and I am playing against my boys Untouchable and Mass Duck 65 along with a bunch of his other troops. And I gotta tell you, first round is nuttier than... Um, I gotta word this right. Nuttier than a sweet payday bar. So check this out. Okay, I am rocking the FAMAS. You know, doing my thing. You know, one of my boys picks up the bomb. So I head off to the left towards Alpha. And uh, I decide to hang back because somebody might poke his head around the corner. And, you know, yeah, there's definitely activity over there. So I'm just going to hang back, provide some covering fire. <coughs> you know, I'll reload. I'm going to pop the noob tube. And it's right around here that somebody shoots at me. Watch this. Yep, right there. That is my boy, Mass Duck 65 So I'm going to try to take him for a ride in my brand new Cadillac. So, purse, leather seats. Thank you, your beautiful audience. Uh, oh, wait. Really? <laughs> Yes, kids, he fires off his Stinger missile, gets popped, but it manages to get me back. Oh, that wily son of a bitch. <laughs> I swear to God. And I think that's about as exciting as it's going to get, kids. Um, you can't write stuff like that. So, while we're doing this, we're hanging around our Canadian friend here. <laughs> My apologies if you're not Canadian, sir. You just got the Canadian flag in your tag. But, you know, I go to mute this one dude. But there's the proof. It's mass duck and untouchable on the other team. So, this is actually like... this. Oh, watch this knife. Bam! Sealing up the first round for our team. You think there are going to be more rounds, right? Well, I hate to spoil it for you kids, but um, Mass Duck and Untouchable, they're going to get their shit together, and they're going to clean us the F out. So, <laughs> it's not going to be for a lack of effort, though. I'm going to, okay, so I'm thinking, okay, Mass Duck got me with a Stinger Missile, and I was able to pop him in the head with a FAMAS. I want a sniper headshot on him now. So let's see if we get that. I'm actively looking for him, man. He's, he's the guy in the ghillie suit. He's not that hard to find. Um, loves carrying around that sniper rifle to break out the quick scopes. I swear to God, I saw somebody go right behind that building. So, I'm breaking the, I'm breaking the silenced intervention in this match. Um, I gotta say, um, you are really trading uh, power for stealth with, that, with this weapon. And yeah, check it out. Geronimo and all that. Um, but I honestly believe that, you know, if you're gonna, if you're gonna put a silencer on a sniper rifle, especially one such as the Intervention, either play hardcore team deathmatch and have stopping power, or take the silencer off and, uh, you know, hey, it doesn't matter, because this dude, okay, this guy right here, a funny banana, he's gonna get me with, with one of them kills. So perhaps, maybe perhaps, I'll be handing out the Catch the Condor Award this time too. Even though I can't explicitly say that this is an episode of Catch the Condor. If you if you read my, uh, listen to my update video, I have discontinued that series. But anybody that gets any sweet kills on me, I'm telling you what, I'm going to send him a friend request, put his gamer tag in the description, and praise him for his owning of me. So... <coughs> So this dude right here, you know, he's, he's checking in the corners. You know, these bastards can hide anywhere. So I got to give him props for, you know, he's pop, he popped the UAV, trying to see if anybody was getting to him. I think it's just down to him and my boy, Untouchable. So he, he does a smart thing. He routes around to the other side, you know. But um, the jig's going to be up pretty soon because he's going to plant the bomb. It's real in interesting to try to see how you deal with this kind of stuff. I mean... Sometimes you gotta be careful. And look, he gets popped right there. So, oh no, I, I'm actually mistaken. Well, no, it's not up. T I don't believe it is untouchable. He's fighting. I believe it's a funny banana. But uh, you will see one one of my guys go toe to toe with him real soon here. Now watch this. He thinks he's over in the barber shop, right? Well, if you would just take a look up and to your left where that shadow is, yeah. There he is. Yeah, him and his M21 EBR, you know, ha ha ha. 
So he gives us the, you know, curtsy, de, curts, he gives us the Cirque du Disease, and then he pops the smoke like he's the ultimate warrior in WCW. Uh, you gotta be a wrestling fan to appreciate that joke. So the clean sweep begins, officially, but, um, and I, again, you know, if for, so, for my, if my fans would be so inclined to tell me to not do that, not spoil the ending, please, please, please offer me feedback. You know, um, so I'm running around with the intervention. I believe that, um, I think, I, I don't know. I don't think I get any more kills until a little bit later, until we're on defense. So, yeah, you're going to see a couple more rounds where I don't get anybody, but I get owned. But, um, it's kind of a lull in the action here. So, <clears throat> oh, actually, there's not because, um, I'm going to be, okay. Uh, this part, I guess, you know, if, if you're really good at hiding, you can really get away with some stuff. But you really got to watch. Like, look, I'm getting shot here. He could be at one. He could be anywhere. He could be on the roof. He could be in that little middle section there. He could even be, you know, hiding in that little corridor down there or the, or the marketplace right next to it. I have no idea where he's hiding. So I see somebody. Oh, I, I went, I'll go to take a shot. I don't find him. He goes to the other side. Nope, he comes right back in the same side. It's my boy, Untouchable. He's showing me why he truly is Untouchable. Ah, this is the round where he goes one-on-one -on -one with him and fails miserably. Check this out. Wham! <laughs> I gotta tell you, that uh, was pr I mean, I'm, I'm kind of surprised. He went to plant the bomb, he went away, and I really got to apologize for putting my pause screen on that. That was a really sweet kill. He's going to have my head for that. But, you know, he didn't plant the bomb. He went off to the side, you know. Oh, and this is where I try to change my class to assault, but for some dumbass reason, it doesn't stick. So I thought, okay, I guess I'm going to be a sniper. <laughs> and it's a good thing I do, too, because, boy, I'm going to take somebody for a ride in my brand new Cadillac. If you know what I mean. And, you know, get your head out of the gutter, you pervs. I'm going to get somebody with a nice, long headshot. So, but, um, just wait and see, kids. Just wait and see. See, I, I, can, I can keep surprises, <laughs> I suppose. Um, so we get first blood. Watch this. You sit down. Yes, you sit down. Um... Yeah, that is only Use Me Blades line. Don't think he knows I'm on YouTube, though, so I think I can get away with it. For the, for the time being, at least. Though he might send Blunt Smoking Anus Destroyer after me and completely evaporate my ass. But, anyway. Um, back to the task at hand, hunting down the rest of these sons of bitches. Um, it's really hard to try to figure out where these guys are hiding. Uh, there's there's so many good hiding spots on this map. You, you can you can hide on the roof. You, you can you know go in and out of the buildings and stuff. Uh, it's just insane. It's it's a I, I like this map a lot. A lot of people like this map too. Um, I think we're trying to coordinate with each other, trying to figure out where they're at. I think we got about three of us. And then we thought then we think to ourselves, hey, maybe w want to check their spawn. So hell, I'm not doing anything. I'll um. I'll go check out the spawn, and I don't find anybody. But, you know, there's always that one guy on the team that, you know, had to go get a sandwich or had to take a shit or something, but he, <laughs> he ends up sticking around the spawn, and he's not doing anything. That's kind of a hard call for me to make, because I don't want to sit there and knock this guy out, you know, when he's not doing anything. Now, check this out. You want to call him a funny banana? <laughs> he gets He catches me in midair. Pops me right in the cordoid artery, right in my left leg, I believe. Him and his silenced M21 EBR. Congratulations, a funny banana. You are the next recipient of the Catch the Condor Award. But um, all is not lost, kids. I'm about to take some poor fool for a ride. So check this out. I see this guy up here, right? He pokes his head. Shoot once. Miss. Shoot twice. Miss. Gonna take it for a ride in my... Brand new Cadillac. Thank you, your beautiful audience. Tip your waitress. Oh, I really love that. I, I don't think I don't think there's any bigger thrill you can get in this game than getting a long distance headshot like that. I tell me tell me, you know, besides getting a nuke, and there's there's my boy Funny Banana really peeling me up. 
And yes, thank you. I'll be here all week. Enjoy the veal. So, this is the last round, and unfortunately, yes, the clean sweep will manifest itself. So, I am going to say that um, thanks to Untouchable and Masked Duck 65 uh, gets this one dude, but he's going to get knifed, like, real soon here. Um, actually, it's 3, 2, 1, knifed. There you go. Uh, Condor falls to the combined might of Mass Duck 65 and Untouchable, and the dude that I knifed earlier picks up the winning kill. I uh, go three and six, I believe. And uh, as always, kids, do your best to catch the Condor. I'm out like a black polyester suit.